More on the road conditions in just a moment, including AAA's record-breaking day. But we begin with a rescue story tonight. Members of a Chesterfield family owe their lives to a good Samaritan after running their car off the road and landing 25 feet down a snow-covered embankment. The driver of that car, 37-year-old Kevin Walker, is now charged with DUI and felony child endangerment. His five-year-old twins were in the car with him. New at 11, Laura Geller joins us with details of a daring rescue. Sabrina, what would you do if an accident happened right before your very eyes? Would you stop, call police, help with the rescue? For one truck driver last night, the answer to every one of those questions was yes. And state police say because of those actions, a family is alive tonight. There was no way passing traffic can't see it. We couldn't have seen it. Had it not been for the quick thinking of one man, we would be telling a very different story. State police say Sunday night, Kevin Walker ran his 2001 Saturn off I-95 North near the Pocahontas Interchange. It plummeted down this steep, snow-covered embankment, finally landing upside down in a creek 25 feet below the highway. Walker and his five-year-old twins were trapped. The vehicle was partially in a creek and partially in the uh, a frozen part of the creek and in the snow. Uh, and it was upside down. Just as he was passing by, truck driver Joseph Weevil saw the car nosedive over the guardrail. He immediately pulled over and called state police. Sergeant Chris Clark was first on the scene of what became a challenging rescue. There's about a 20, 25 foot wall here to drop, so I, I knew I couldn't safely drop down here. Weevil helped Sergeant Clark make it down the hill and directed other emergency crews to the scene. He stepped up to the plate and was more than willing to help. Clark found the 37-year-old driver and his twins sitting inside the roof of the car waiting for help. They were all taken to the hospital, but amazingly are said to be okay. With the conditions last night, as cold as it was, it, it would been uh, it would been a sad end of the story. Again tonight, Kevin Walker faces one charge of driving under the influence and two felony counts of child endangerment. Laura Geller, NBC 12 News.